Hello there everyone, my name is Ayumu Kagami, welcome to the Binding of Isaac. We're gonna play it, mods is not what I meant to hit. Let's do April Fool's Challenge. What could it be? It's April Fool's. Who literally, who knows what anything could be. I, I kind of do. So, this challenge randomizes like everything. So, uh, items and stuff are not what they appear. So, bombs? Half necro hearts. What up? Call your doctor. Tell him you feel strange. If your doctor is Doctor Strange, then... Is he actually a doctor? Yeah, so everything is like random in what it actually is. So... It's pretty cool! Uh, including the items you find... Okay, just joke to death. Even the descriptions and everything like that, they're all random. You don't know what anything is, and that's pretty cool. Uh, from what I know is that the map is actually the map. Like, the, the actual layout of it is correct, but the... Um, where, like, what you can see is not correct. Also... <laughs> April Fools, like every single boss is the bloat. <laughs> so Happy April Fools everybody. It's a holiday of tricks and pranks and treaks and Greeks. Usually not the Greeks though, actually. But it's a pretty cool challenge. There are item rooms as well. I just didn't go to it. Because, you know, I'm, I'm tough enough to fight the bloat with base damage and not lose all of my health. <laughs> Confidence is key, my friends. Confidence and a whole bunch of prayer and hope. And not fighting the bloat oh, ever again. Except for the fact that, here's the fun part, uh, the bloat <laughs> pops up a lot. When I said a lot, I mean, like, literally a lot. Uh, we might fight him five times this run. And by that, I mean probably, like, three. Maybe four. It can be other bosses. It's just, like, always the blimp. So. That's good stuff. Don't you agree? I agree. I agree, and I'm a good judge of character. So you should believe what I believe. I... Man, dude, spirit hearts? I don't want that crap. Those just make you weak and soft and durable and able to succeed the first time you do a run. Who wants that? Really? Who wants that? You see? Double vision. Mom's coin purse. Mind equals blown. Speed down pill? Actually luck. Infamy. Not the uh, wig. Range down. So if you can actually keep up with like where what the map looks like, it's not that difficult. You okay? We didn't know we had one of these, so that's kind of awesome. So I gotta be careful around this one. Actually, not really careful, but I would rather have this movable one that actually doesn't matter because these move fairly quickly. The chests do. Well, I thought they moved much slower. We're gonna push it over here. Anyway, one push at a time, slowly, but surely. And we're gonna blow it up. Oh, look at all those sweet goodies. Dude, we don't really know what they are. You think it's Chub, but it's Odd Mushroom. And that thing. You think it's the book but it's mom's wig excuse me i wanted to go whole run without mom's wig because we saw the item think you're gonna go the whole run without an item well bam don't even know what's going on anymore uh but i uh, the the gold the gold heart i guess i'll call it is the best thing you can get in the run because that is the key to your destiny 
because uh, when it when you lose it, you get a bunch of money, like five pennies. But here's the thing: are they actually pennies? <laughs> I'm glad you asked, there, my dear friend. No, no, they are not actually pennies. They could be anything. They could be five spirit hearts. They could be five bombs. They could be five half spirit hearts. So two and a half spirit hearts. The possibilities literally limitless. It could even be five pennies. I know. Mind-boggling indeed. And I don't remember if like, yeah. So I don't remember if you actually keep the effects of them. Uh, that said, I can see forever. And we got infestation. Because uh, April Fools, you don't know anything. You thought you knew. You don't know. See? A sack of things. Bam! Money equals power. Now we're stronger than ever with plus 10 damage. Wait, why, why is my damage so low? Oh yeah, because I have the book of buckery. It's the mushroom. This is the mushroom that gave it to me. There's no book of fuckery. Mod idea! Free mod idea! Make the book of fuckery. Think it's a spear heart? Plus one penny. That's right. One penny more than no pennies. Think they're red hearts? They're... I think they're actually red hearts. I don't, I don't think red hearts change. And I can't check because I haven't taken damage yet. But here he comes! Back in action! Let's just not actually have that because pfft, we didn't really want it. We wanted different things. We didn't want the freaking uh, what was it? High Priestess? We wanted better things. Like the Temperance card? Because it's April Fool's. And if you don't get along with the if you don't laugh at it, then you're the one who's the fool. April Fool's. Dudes. Bros. Comrado Rose. Pecans. What's a pecan, Sandy? I know it's supposed to be like some kind of um, cookie type thing, but what's an act? What actually is a pecan, Sandy? I don't know. I guess we'll check to see if hearts are hearts. You thought it was anemic. Squeezy. Yeah, okay, so one of my problems with this, I don't have a lot of problems with this, like, actual, like, challenge thing, but red hearts aren't red hearts, but you can't pick up red hearts unless you're missing red hearts. Like, there were no red hearts there. So, what's a red heart? We're looking around for red hearts, and there are no red hearts. See? Not a red heart. But can a red heart be a red heart? The world may never know. I would really like a red heart, though. So, just saying. Hey, we're almost up to base damage. That's not too shabby, if you ask my opinion. But we'll keep going. Caves 1, Curse of the Blind. Pfft, I didn't know what anything was anyway. I'm good with that. The only way I'd know is if I was a psychic. And I'm not. So, checkmate. Alright, well let's just attack this guy. He's dead. Ooh, look! A tinted rock! Is it a spirit heart? Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah! Uh. It's, uh, something. Lead pencil. Fun fact. One. I don't actually know. Do we actually have the lead pencil? Yeah, so the item, like, list sitting off to the side does not lie. But. I am. Not proud of this damage that I have been taking. Mm, I think this can blow up both of them. Hopefully, hopefully. Beautiful. We got. 
Like, literally nothing. Oh, maybe you can't pick up red hearts on the run, and that's also part of the April Fools! <laughs> the Steam Sale! Actually, it was like, actually, the Steam Sale deck of cards. And it gave us a random effect, because it's not actually the deck of cards. Wait, did I not get a spacebar item last time I did this challenge? Hey, what's up? Don't don't take damage. Just don't. Stop it. Find medical attention. Oh, there are red hearts in it. Okay. They're just not actually red hearts. Alright, so we just want to go skedaddle up here. And that actually is where we wanted to go, ultimately. Oh yeah, take it out as quick as possible. Get that sweet, sweet tinted rock. And all necro hearts. All the time. Look at that! A third bloat! I wasn't kidding. We fight the bloat non-stop. For real. Uh, I wish it was a joke. But it's not. That's why, even though it's only going to mom, it's not necessarily the easiest of challenges. Because, well, uh, a floor one bloat, not knowing... Oh god, what item is what is insanely difficult. In comparison to, you know, just being guppy. I like being guppy, though. Being guppy is my favorite. Me and guppy have a long history. The first run I ever did in The Binding of Isaac on my Vita, I was Guppy. What do you think of that? Torn photo. But wait, was it really the torn photo? We don't know. One heart? What's it gonna be? Uh, losing a heart. Uh, dead cat. And the pact. I probably actually shouldn't have taken those, because that was foolish. Because I got dead cat. Whoops. Oh well. You'll win some, you lose some. We won't lose this one. Also, let me know if you want to see, like, all of the struggles. Because uh, I'm fine, like, repeating challenges here. If I get, like, too stuck, I, I might just not. Uh, I'll do it, like, off camera. I'll, I'll just do it on stream. But... I don't know, let me know. If you want to see, like... Less... Is less more to you? And by that, I mean, like, do you want to see more... But also less? Like, if I die five minutes in... Or if I complete a challenge five minutes in... No, I would probably just do another one. Uh, Abaddon? What item is that? I think that's Abaddon. No, Abaddon's different. I don't actually remember if Abaddon's different. We have Continuum, though, and Continuum's an awesome item. It's silly. Because you're all like, oh, you want to stand over there and I can't hit you? Well, bam, I should actually face the enemy. I don't know what that did that time, but that's okay. I don't need to know what an item does to win a run. That's what happens when you're the best. Or mildly successful. At the Binding of Isaac. Oh, also, uh, game-breaking runs. Do you want to see those? Uh, obviously, if it's in the game. If it's I'm just playing right here, it's going to see it regardless. But, like, uh, if it's a... Something I did on stream. Do you want to see those here? Comments. Let me know. Let me find out. I'm going to learn from you to me to you what you guys want to see. I.E. Please just let me know. I would appreciate that sincerely. Yeah! More Necro Hearts. Um... I think this run's going pretty good so far. We got lots of items. We got lots of Stragonth. We have... 
two uh, golden hearts, which is awesome, because that makes it so that we can see even more random new stuff. Oh, uh, I will not be doing all of greed mode here. That's something uh, I probably will. like. I, I mean, I'll, I'll like have like a successful greed runner, like as many as I need. Unless you guys don't want to see like the those. I don't know. I don't know, dog. I gotta know from you. Oh, what's up? Why is the guy always stuck in the fire? I want to release him before I murder him. I feel bad about it. Uh, I don't know what I did. I feel like that was the prayer card. I'm also just unsure if that was the prayer card. Ow. Okay. Look at that. More gold. Golden hearts. Sweet. I... I'm enjoying this. Okay, so that was four. I was kind of kidding when I said we could get five of them. When I did it, I got three. I actually got a different enemy. Wait, this goes to the heart? I thought this went to mom. I want to say I'm super confused, but... <laughs> I mean, I'm super confused. Oh well, whatever. Half the fun of it is just getting to play longer. And now it won't be a 15 and a half minute episode, even though it wouldn't be anyway, because it's 16 minutes and 53 seconds. That's right, I got my timer out. I'm all responsible like that. Mostly because the whatever I'm recording in does it for me. That doesn't mean I'm not responsible, though. So! was uh well I well I sit here in this room uh one of the things I wanted to kind of mention is uh negativity bad stuff happens don't don't let it ruin your day uh there was something like there's 80 800 there's a bunch of seconds in a day and the metaphor that was used metaphor simile the example that was used was, uh, <clears throat> and I'm going to word this incorrectly because I don't remember how much time there was in a day, but for argument's sake, you have eight, uh, 80,000 seconds in a day. No, you have $80,000 and someone steals $10 from you. Do you throw away the rest of the $80,000 to spite the person who took $10 from you. The big room has no other entrances? Um... There. But would, would you just spite the rest of your money? Just throw it all away because someone took ten dollars and the point it was making is if someone is a douche nugget to you should you give up excuse me holy shit i'm invincible uh should you throw away uh, I want my pencil back. Okay, I have both of them now. <laughs> but, should you throw away the rest of your day because someone was an asshole to you, or something bad happened? It doesn't always have to be someone mad at you. Um, sometimes it's just bad things happen. Uh, bad things happen today. It kind of bummed me out. Obviously, I'm not upset at whoever I was, it's just... There's bad things. I don't like bad things. I like good things. I'm mother now. Um, so I'm glad that they could talk to me about it. It was it was serious bad stuff. It wasn't like someone's like, hey, you're a, uh, a butt-munch, douche-nickel, fudge-faced liar. Although that would just probably make me laugh. 
Oh, it ruins Continuum. But it's kind of like uh, I had an Isaac run, and it went really well on stream. And I beat uh, the Hush, and it was awesome. And I didn't know that the when the Hush unlocks with its more difficult, or uh, when the Hush uh, fight ends the first time you beat the Hush, it unlocks an extra enemy thing. And I'm sorry if I'm spoiling that for you, my bad. Um, but now you'll know that if it does happen, you know, just leave the room and come back. So I did not leave the room and come back. I left the room. And by that, I mean I went into the chest and ended my run. So, in a way, I, I could have been li uh, all, like, super angry. Um, I asked the question, I was like, do I just jump in the chest? And I just jumped in it. I didn't wait for anyone's response. I have no one to blame but myself. But, should I let that ruin the fact that I had one of the best runs of my life? I had, like, quad tech X. It was awesome. But, should I let that ruin it? I had an awesome run. It was freaking amazing. And that's how I want to have it. Yeah, it, it stinks I wasn't able to get the new floor. Uh, although apparently now it's... I don't want to say anything that, that's wrong, so I'll keep my mouth shut about it so far. But I still had an amazing run. And that was awesome. Uh, I think I also had scythes, so I was doing even more damage, and it was literally, like, just a spite run of RNG Jesus to, uh, Alan, Fat Albert, uh, <laughs> because, like, literally he's like, <laughs> well, how come RNG gives you all the luck? I got, uh, the Magic Mosh as my boss item, no, out of, out of an item room, I think, then I got, like, the Pentagram immediately, and then I got, and then I got, it was, it was crazy. It was, oh boy, was it a good run. So. Try not to let some things bother you too much. Because sometimes it's literally not worth it. A lot of the time it's not. Bad stuff happens, and that sucks. But you don't have to let it ruin your day. I mean, obviously, like, coping with more serious matters is an entirely different thing, and I'm not telling you, like, not to handle different situations differently. But, if at all possible, don't let your day get ruined by some bad things. That's what I wanted to say. Daddy long legs. Daddy's love. I have no clue where I'm going. I suppose this way? What's the strength card do? Oh, I can just skip the mom fight altogether. Nah. I'm good. I'm not good. I have no clue where the hell I'm going. I'm gonna go now. I was going to mom's part of the April Fool's joke. I don't remember. I really don't remember. Well, whatever. If it ends poorly, I'll just do it off camera. Or I won't. I'll do it on camera in a little bit. I'll do it, like, immediately afterwards. That'd be silly. I should really leave that money on the grounds. So I can populate and bear fruit once again. In the future. Except for the fact that I already have a trillion hearts. The frig is shooting after I'm done. Hmm. Cool. So! 
one of the things I've been um, asking people, I want to ask you guys this as well. MMOs, what are your thoughts? Wow, look at that, it's the bloat. That's crazy. Who would have thought the bloat would be here? It's just a small world. Horn. Why not? Dark bow. I don't care about him picking up those. I'm not worried. Not in the slightest. Oh yeah, so the reason I was asking is, uh, MMOs. Shiitake mushrooms. Uh, it, it's kind of like very hit or miss on them. Um. It's so always interested in getting other people's feedback on it. Yeah, money is definitely the way to go. <laughs> Uh, and what makes like what makes an MMO in more enjoyable than the, than others? Um, personally, I'm a bigger fan of uh, Final Fantasy XIV. I may be getting back into it soon. Not doing videos of of, of it uh, unless you guys like really want to see it. Let me know that. But uh, just for my own. I've been trying to find a game I can just, like, screw off with while talking to people and not feel bad because I'm not paying any attention. Um, or just something that requires more... I don't want to say, like, less attention to it because that's kind of rude to MMOs. But less attention to it. You know, I could just sit there and I could craft items. And you're gone. Okay. Oh, also, it gets an update in like 10 days. And you know what else comes out in like 10 days? <gasps> That's right, Kingdom Hearts. Which I'm gonna try and balance Kingdom Hearts and uh, Streams of Isaac. The day that it comes out, I'll probably just like literally do Isaac. I mean, I'm sorry. Yeah, the day it comes out, I'll just not play it. Um, but the day it comes out, I will probably just like marathon the hell out of it so I'm really excited about it yeah it's gonna be so good I'm, I'm super excited about it um, I want to see like what they're doing with it is that the end of it? That's the end of it. Um, like what kind of stuff they're adding in. I don't know if I want to do it on YouTube or not. Or stream. I'm probably going to do it on stream. It's going to be a very long game. I don't know yet, though. And two. Wait, hold on. Did they update it so it's literally always the bloat? Okay. It's always the bloat. Maggie now holds a pill. Thank you very much for watching, everybody. I sincerely appreciate it. Hit that subscribe button if you want to catch more The Burning of Isaac or literally anything else. What's a game you want me to play on the channel? Let me know. Give me your thoughts. Stay beautiful, people. Bye-bye.